Now a professor of epidemiology at the University of Health and Allied Sciences, Professor Fred Binker, has shot down the implementation of the Agenda 111 policy as a measure to prepare for a pandemic. He says the construction of 111 district health facilities is not feasible, indicating the projects would only increase the number of uncompleted government structures due to the lack of funding. He was speaking at the University of Health and Allied Sciences Send Ghana, Ghana Health Advocacy Incubator Symposium on Public Health Emergency Funding. One of the, the two critical things that we took out from the COVID was that there were not enough health facilities across the country. So we rightly started what is called Agenda 111 to increase health infrastructure, okay? 111 hospitals, goodness. That's a great idea, but why couldn't we just say, okay, this year we'll build 20, next year 20, till we get to what? 111. So far, we haven't built any, okay? When is the first one going to finish? So we've just gone on, on a tangent. The truth of the matter is that the Agenda 111 will have many uncompleted structures in the bush at the end of the day. That's the truth. You all know it. I've not seen the budget for the equipment. Building brick and mortar is not a hospital. If you can't find money to build a brick and mortar, how are you going to fund the equipment? Number two, have you made preparations for the human resource that make the hospital function? As of yesterday, I had 6,000 nurses have, have gone to real greener pastures, and more will follow. 6,000, this is not a joke. So we got 100 million to start up the Agenda 111. Look, sometimes I'm not sure how these things work, but at the last count, we were told that the Agenda 111 cost almost a billion dollars. When you get 100 million, you don't start to build 111. You have to face it in. Or now you have started 111 uh, hospitals all over the place. Have you got the nine, 900 million? Now we are to IMF. Big IMF comes and says, I'm sorry, you can't be investing in capital expenditure when you can't find money to pay your salaries of your workers. Oh, you can't give textbooks to your, your school people. I don't want to get into that policy.